So, you know how to use all the menu tools except for one, the scroll view. Not a problem. Scroll view is actually a combination of two different tools, the scroll bar and the view. Let's talk about the bar first. A scroll bar is almost exactly the same as a slider. It has all the functions of a button, it has triggers, and you can control its direction. And just like a slider, it goes from zero to one. You can also change the size to whatever you want, and it will automatically adjust the drag values. It will also determine how many steps it takes to go from one side to another. Normally, it starts off at zero, which which means it's smooth, but if you change it to something like three and try to slide it, you will notice that is now how many steps it takes to get to the other side. And if you right click UI and pick scroll view, you will see this. Now it will come with two scroll bars at the bottom ready to go. You can customize their settings if you want, but for now I recommend you just ignore them because I promise they're doing the job. So down here, you'll see something called content. That's where you come in. Whatever it is that you want the player to scroll through, here is where you put it. For now, let's just say that you wanted to put in a real long ass picture. First thing you do is decide how big this area should be. So go to the main object, just make sure it's the size that you want, then decide how big the content inside should be. I'm just gonna assume the content will go down to about here. Then I'm gonna create my image, drag it into my content, and if you play the game now, you will see that immediately we can start dragging the scroll bars to go through our content. Like everything else, Unity does most of the work for you. So if you change the size of the content to go beyond the bounds of the main object, you'll see the scroll bars automatically make adjustments to allow you to go from side to side. Now, if you click on the main object, you'll see a lot of different settings. But all you really need to know is you can disable the horizontal or vertical scroll abilities with these. So if you just want it to go up and down, just uncheck horizontal. Elastic just means it will snap back into place. Unrestricted means it will drift around without snapping back. And clamp means that it will never go outside the content. Inertia means when you flick the screen, it will slow down gradually. If you turn it off, the window will stop moving as soon as your mouse or fingers let go. The lower the deceleration, the faster it'll stop moving after flicking up or down. And that's really it. If you want to access these things from code, just make sure to add using unityengine.ui, make a public variable for the scroll view, then set its properties to whatever you want. Hope that helps and congratulations. That was the last menu UI feature. So you now know how to use all the GUI options in Unity. It's real powerful stuff and now it's yours. And as always, hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you around.